what is good guys I'm here with Shulker vs Megan we only missed two turns again turn one Shulker missed a will wisp on a tender cruel M Megan went for Gigadran and turn two he got a crit with Gigadran that's why the Rotom missed that low yeah this is black and white OUSBL week two I think Megan is on the which team is he on? He's on the Circus Maximus Tigers and Shokas are the Fartons. The score is 4 and 3. Shokas goes hard Dragon Knight, so the multi scale is broken. Never mind, it's left over Dragon Knight. Okay, that play makes sense. That So, he will lose the Tether Crew the second time. Oh wow, it's Hurricane. So, is he relying? Is Shokas relying on his opponent to bring rain so he can hit Hurricanes? Or does he have like raid deads or toad or something? I have no idea. As Hurricane confuses the toad and then the Thudris comes in. Uh, is that Scarf Thudris? I think Scarf is Scarf or Double Deads, right? That was a bit risky by Shoka because it could be Grass not Thunderous, but I guess he assumed he would never um, Grass not when a Dragon is out on the field, which is like kind of a threat. Is this a uh, swift sim? It's probably swift sim toad, right? Like, I, I don't know, he doesn't have rain unless it's like rain dance, but I don't know if he has to rely on the opponent to set the rain for him, it's leftover, so it's probably defensive then. Leftover swift sim is weird, like, I think swift sim was like life orb. The pharaoh will probably get ahead of yeah. I don't know why the pharaoh's red is looking so weird. The hurricane had nothing. What? It's left you three right? What? What? What does the dragon knight run? If it's hurricane, maybe thunder and fire blast or flamethrower. Now nah, fire blast doesn't make sense if you f boost like. Yeah. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. Fire blast makes sense. There's fire blast. <laughs> I didn't say anything. <laughs> Travel does a ton. Is that like an attack invested ferrothorn? Why did it do so much? Wow. Or oh, it's just like. Timid Dragon Knight, maybe? I'm not sure about that. Shoka's team kinda looks like some Aura's team, honestly. I know he can do the ton, but he's gonna heal back with the, with the Leech Seed. And I assume it back is gonna fire off um either a T bolt or HP eyes. Like I don't think you should risk the size with toad. Oh, he did risk the size with toad. Okay, just HP eyes. I guess the size with was the fight play there. But if I if I'm Shoka I would be so scared of a grass dot. <laughs> Blunder says Swift to manage his Hydro here. I don't think it's Swift to get some rocks. Tether cool. I don't know why he went to Tether cool. Cause oh yeah, it's Giga Drain. Never mind. Never mind. It's Giga Drain to scare the Toad out. I think Megan is uh, spitting here, and I think Shoka's not risking it. Let's take it. I mean, yeah, if if Megan uh, spins and the Toad stays, then he loses his Tether cool. But Shoka needs the Tether cool for that Thunderous. So the Thunderous cannot spam like Volt Switch that freely, yeah he goes for the spin as I expected. I mean yeah, Shoka also has a drill, but the Thunderous might have focus blast or something to hit that. Okay, the jelly tricks. Uh never mind, the Jirachi tricks jelly of the scarf, what am I saying? As it's offen is it offensive Tether Crew because it has higher pump? Seventy-seven. Nah, it's I don't know if it's offensive Terry Crew. It had leftovers to heal more HP, obviously, in rain with rain dish. Does Kelly run? I think Kelly runs HP Ghost in this gen to hit stuff like Jellison. I'm not sure if, it's, if they uh, sometimes run HP Grass. I don't think they do. But uh, yeah, Secret Sword is gonna hurt nonetheless. Like, Shogun doesn't have good switches for Secret Sword, honestly. 
Like he has Landris, but if he goes Landris and the Kelly goes for anything that's not Secret Sword, he's gonna get blown away. Like if Kelly goes for a water move predicting the switch. Mag 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 might just go for a water move because Shoka needs to save the Toad. Um, yeah, I don't think he has. Well, he actually has HP Grass. Wow, and he just kills the Toad. This puts Mag Mag in such a good position. Wow. Because now the only thing that's like kind of stopping the um, Thunderous is the Excadrill. Jirachi also tricked the Scarf away, so Thunderous outspeeds Jirachi. I don't know why Shoka went out the drill. I guess it's, yeah, okay, the Kelly is probably choice locked, is what he assumes. If this is not choice locked, Kelly. Shoka gets blown away by a water move here. <laughs> Which has been not choice, Kelly. Like, Shoka's obviously gotta go for the spin here. Or uh, maybe for SD to get some damage off of the, and kill the Ferrothorn. Okay, he just goes for the spin. But the Ferrothorn can just like... Either go for Power Whip or get the rocks back up. I assume he's gonna get the rocks back, yeah. And the Drag Dice got fire off... Oh, a Roost, okay. I thought he had to Fire Blast there because Jarawa does too much damage. Like, I don't even know if Fire Blast kills. I how much does Fire Blast do earlier? He just keeps roosting. I guess he's trying to stall out the Gyro Ball. But that doesn't work, because it's doing a little bit more than he's healing, right? Actually, that was a low roll. But the thing is, the Ferrothorn is getting healthier. So yeah, McMahon doesn't lose anything by doing this. Because his Ferrothorn is getting lefties. Why is McMang not going for Leech Seed is my question. No, he doesn't have to Leech Seed yet. Okay, McMang switches out, predicting another Roost goes hard Thunderous. And yeah, he can scare this out with an HP eyes now. Never- why did he stay in? What? Dude, McMang is destroying this man. That, that was- I assume Shoka predicted and Megan will go for Focus Blast, predicting Excadrill. If. If. Uh, I don't know if like Sandra's runs Focus Blast, and Shoka just forfeits. <laughs> Dude, um, are they, they're talking about the crit. Did the crit matter on the Tender Crew? Uh, the Tender Crew crit the Rotom is what I meant. And the Rotom missed the Willow Wisp. I mean, that was a bit annoying, but. From what I've seen is McMang completely blew this man away. But I'm not trying to talk shit here. Giggy then crit and then he missed the wisp, yeah. I mean yeah, never mind his Rotom was low. Like I assumed his Rotom was healthy and could go Rotom here, but he couldn't go. Yeah, okay, never mind. Shoka didn't really have a counterplay to HPIs at this point. X could have like would have taken two once, but Excluder really cannot even break Mag's team. Yeah, and Jirachi lost the scarf, so it's too slow, and it's only towards 22%. There's a Ferrothorn. Double Dance Landris, uh, yeah. But then it's like it's only Wincon if it was Double Dance, but how does that. Like, Megan wouldn't have allowed him to set up at all. So, yeah, since Megan blew him away, it's like the score is 5 and 3 for the Circus Max Mix. Maximus Tigers. Um, Nintendo's playing with X Ray later. It's pretty interesting. P2 vs. Cicada. Uh, Sunmoon Uyo. Sunmoon Uyo is always nice. So, yeah, looking forward to that. And see you guys next time. I'm gonna end this here. This is a bit shorter than have a guest in this one, but that's all good, right? I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Smash that like button if you wanna see more SPL content. Doc, signing up. Peace.